Throughout the film, The Holy Land of Tyrol, there are many symbolic scenes similar to those told in biblical and Greek mythology. First, director Philip J. Palmer has stated that the relationship between Franz and his brothers was inspired by Joseph and his brothers. Film reviewer Dr. Les K. Wright has found another analogy. Quote, the film settles into its story of how Katerina, played by Inga Birkenfeld, came to live among her husband's people. In some ways, the film echoes the biblical story of Ruth. It is also the story of Franz, played by Wolfgang Minardi and his brothers. More faint echoes this time of Joseph and his brothers. Bavaria and the Tyrol are both deeply Catholic cultures." End quote. Director Philip J. Palmer further points out that early in the film, while in Katerina's city of Augsburg, there are statues of various saints which were made by Christians in the early 19th century as a way to honor their saints. The St. Ulrich statue, the one used to kill the French soldier, was made to honor St. Ulrich, Bishop of Augsburg. In the 19th century, he was the leader of the Roman Catholic Church in Germany and the first saint to be canonized. Many miracles are said to have happened at his grave. The story of Katerina is based on the ideals found in Song of Songs from the Bible. The protagonists of Song of Songs are a woman and a man, and the poem suggests movement from courtship to consummation. One can also interpret it as a parable of the relationship of Jesus and the Church, or in this special case, God and Tyrol. When Katerina dreams of Franz, she dreams of him being responsible for the death of her child. As a hooded monk, he stabs her womb with a cross. Perhaps this is symbolic of his faith and country acting as a force between them. The three mountains also contained in the dream are symbolic of the pyramids of Giza and the cruel history associated with them. The film delves into Greek mythology with the parallels of Franz's coming back from war with a wound on his heel and the story of the Greek hero Achilles. Achilles was thought to be invincible but later died from a small wound on his heel. Franz is a modern variant of Achilles, differing in that the wound is the death of Achilles, whereas here, the wound actually saves Franz's life. Further symbolism is seen after Katerina hurts her husband and leaves the farm, and she finds a dead deer covered with ants. The deer is symbolic of the death of her innocence. And finally, a very interesting piece of trivia. The black rosary chain in the film was the original rosary chain of Andreas Hofer from 1809. The rosary denotes the prayer beads used to count the series of prayers that make up the rosary, as well as the sequence of prayers. The prayers consist of repeated sequences of the Lord's Prayer, followed by ten prayings of the Hail Mary and a single praying of Glory Be to the Father. Each of these sequences is known as a decade. The praying of each decade is accompanied by meditation on one of the mysteries of the rosary, which recall the life of Jesus Christ.